Good morning. I really had a bad sleep yesterday night. I don't know why. It's been a long time since I've done a vlog. So today we are gonna do a couple of things. The first thing we're gonna do is go get some coffee. Okay, because I'm very sleepy and grumpy. After that, I'm gonna go buy some grocery. I'm not gonna bring you along. But after that, we are going to review the car wrap. Previously, it was grey colour. And then my mom decided to spray it. Did they spray it or wrap it? I don't know. To change the color to yellow color. Okay, so it's my mom's car, not mine. Totally not mine. After that, I'm gonna bring you to a dinner to a restaurant where there's like an ocean view. Other than that, yeah, let's enjoy the day and let's go out. So we are gonna go eat some breakfast first, actually brunch, because I woke up late and have my coffee, so let's go! I'm not really hungry but I'm gonna have my ice latte and yeah let's eat there are people way more richer than me just now I went to the supermarket and some snacks for my supper and all that and my Korean noodle. Okay, I just came back from coffee, feeling better. Let me pull my mic first in case you can't hear me. So the car is going to come later at 2 p.m. 2 p.m. My watch is not even working. So right now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do some reading because yesterday I don't wanna do anything. Like I was just like school this stuff. Maybe I just need a break. So he said I just took a whole day break doing almost nothing, just playing some games, then watching some random YouTube videos. But now I'm trying to like finish up the book that I'm reading right now, this book and also like this stack of books over here. And I also need to spend the Sunday cleaning this up because it's kind of messy up here. Then I also need to clean up this place a little bit and also all my Messy, messy stationery and all that. I need to organize it, place it nicely here. So later we're gonna go out for dinner and gotta go exercise first. So now I'm gonna bring you for dinner and hopefully we can catch the sunset but if we can't then we'll just enjoy the meal. If you've watched the previous vlog, there's no space to put stuff so you only buy sport car for fun, not for practical purposes. 
Dankeschön. Is it me or is it just everybody's wearing black? The other day I drank too much the whole jug. The next day hangover. Video. That jobs. That jobs. Hello. Okay, so I just came back home. So let me just say a couple of things. Okay. It was a really good dinner. I'm not sitting on my chair now because I just came back. I don't want to spread the germs to my chair and bed and all that. So I posted a picture earlier today and then there are people who are like, Oh, your mom's car, then it's your car. No. The way I see it is that their money is their money. Okay? Their money is their money. And if they do buy me a meal, which they always do, and if they do like buy stuff for me, which are normally books. If they do buy me books, buy me stuff, then that's a bonus because I don't expect my parents to like constantly give me stuff. Like I don't feel like they owe me anything. In fact, every time I come see them, I will try to give them money and then I'll try to like buy like bags that they really like. So I try to find ways to give my parents and I try not to ask money from my parents I used to do that when I was in high school, okay? Mom, Dad, can you give me some money? Like, but then when I moved out, I told myself I want to depend on myself. And I feel embarrassed to even take money from my parents. Because now I can depend on myself, I never ask my parents for like, hey, can you give me like $500? Like that. No more. I try to avoid that as much as possible. So my parents, they have a Porsche... I used to say Porsche, like Porsche. Then my mom has a Mercedes. Then my stepdad has a, what you call it? Four wheel drive BMW. Is that what you call, you know, those BMW that is a bit more high up? Because personally, I believe in one thing is that when I earn the money myself and I spend it myself, it's more satisfying. I know that if they keep on buying things for me, I wouldn't value it. But if I buy things for myself with my own money, I will treasure it, I will value it. Okay, of course I treasure whatever they buy for me, I'm grateful, but that sense of satisfaction, you just gotta experience it yourself. And, and to those naysayers who like to say, you're rented the car, okay? Whatever you say is a reality to you, okay? We have the documents where we bought the car, okay? Those people who are jealous, oftentimes they'll be like, rented, you rented this chair, okay? You rented this jacket too, okay? This cupboard, you rented this cupboard too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm not doing this vlog to like, flex to you or anything like that. First thing first is because I love sports car, I love like luxury cars. So filming the process of like painting it from grey to yellow, it's very fun to me. Like it's very fun for me to edit such videos as well. And second thing, I hope that it inspires you to like work hard, you know, like 
Let's say if you really want a certain car, but you cannot get it now because you're not financially there yet, then I hope that this inspires you to work hard because I can tell after I've had meals with billionaires, millionaires these past three months, okay? All of them have one thing in common is they work super hard. Super hard, they're patient, they're disciplined, they are not entitled. When they face setbacks, they don't give up. And even when they are rich, they still keep working. You know what I'm saying? And one funny thing, one funny thing. I've seen a lot of multi-millionaires, billionaires, okay? They still be like, okay, let me just try to save some money, okay? Try not to spend too much on myself. Because a lot of people would think that, okay, if I'm a billionaire, I would splash on yacht, private jet, Lamborghini. Maybe some people like that, but the ones that I've met, they are super, super frugal. Super, super frugal. So if anything, I hope that this vlog inspires you to like work hard on your goals. I've worked hard in my 20s and in my late teens, almost to the point where I didn't even live my 20s properly. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I'm okay with that because like, I'm okay with not partying, not going to random outings, to movies, shopping. Of course, I shop once in a while, but I don't go out very often. So I just study and work in my 20s, work hard. Because I was working so hard, sacrificing so much in my 20s, that is why nowadays I can spend a lot of time with my family, okay? Don't ever feel that my life has been easy. Okay, what you see in this vlog is the result. So I don't want you to be like, assume that life has been easy. No, no. Even with all this, okay, on many days I still feel sad. And then like also this pandemic has um, shut down a lot of things. The things that I used to do, I could not do anymore. And that was really hard to adjust for me. But I'm not complaining, you know, I try to be grateful every day. At least I can like stay home and read, you know, and work on my trading. You know what I'm saying? Even though I could not do things that I used to do, like speaking. Then also I could not compete in swimming, which is also a very big part of my identity, my life. So when that was taken away from me, I felt so lost for a couple of months. But every day I just tell myself, you know, just be grateful for what you have. Don't focus on what you don't have. Just focus on what you can do now and then let the pandemic resolve itself because eventually it will. We are all in this together, okay? You might be facing your own problems. I have my own problems. I have days like that, okay? Which is why I need to get help. I know it sounds a bit ungrateful, but there are past trauma that I need to deal with all this stuff, mental health stuff I need to deal with. It's hard to explain to you, okay? That aside, I just hope that this vlog motivates you to work hard on your goals, okay? Motivates you to hustle, sacrifice, because eventually everything else is going to be worth it, okay? So with that, talk to you in the next video. Bye.